There's going to be an Eastern European chick naked in your house. And you're not going to do anything about that? What am I going to do, huh? Broadcast her over the internet? And now, back to the Big Dog Fun Show. Broadcasting over the internet, across the airwaves, and around the world, it's the Big Dumb Fun Show. My name is Aaron. I'm Bankman. And I'm Rena. We are in studio with a couple IFC gals. Mm-hmm. Crystal Hybe. Hybe. And Nicole Santorella <laughs> from the IFC. IFC is he KC saying that right? Dot com. It's, okay. it's, <laughs> which means no. Well, no it That's like fine. Yeah. yeah. Really Not going to happen. Good. Of which, uh, Nicole said, I really love the show. I've been listening for years now. I've been dying to get on to the oh, show. Yeah, totally. And uh, yeah. recently became a fan on Facebook, so we appreciate <laughs> like that. <today. laughs> like, it was today, about five minutes before we uh, walked in the studio. So. No, but uh, actually, when I when, you, when I stalked you, found you on Facebook, um, I saw that you were uh, friends uh, with several folks. Uh, one of them, uh, Brad Westmar, and he's what your your yeah. your BFF for oh, life. Yeah, now, yeah, what, what's yeah, up with what Westy? I pretty much uh, nominated him to be my best friend. He didn't have a choice. Did he accept the nomination? <laughs> oh, or? Yeah. He's been he's been great mm-hmm. carrying my purse. Oh, you know, all oh, that kind of fun sounds stuff. like something that's it's right up his is alley. Is that a BFF that he would or? A <laughs> Weird. No, he doesn't do that. <laughs> no, but Brad's got a show on Jackalope Radio. Yeah. Jackalope Radio is owned by Todd Sheets. Mm-hmm. Todd Sheets is producing a show right now called The House of Forbidden Secrets. That is correct. And you co-star in House of Forbidden Secrets. Yes, sir. So, Six Degrees from Kevin Bacon, that's how <laughs> somehow you get in studio with us today, and that's uh, that's amazing. Mm-hmm. You want to tell us a little bit about uh, the Forbidden Secrets? Because we haven't had a chance to talk with him about it at all. Yeah, Other than absolutely. he said he was going to start working on something. That's the last we heard. <laughs> yeah, no, it's pretty great. Uh, it's a horror film. Uh, not something I've really done before. I've done thrillers, mm-hmm. but it's it's been a lot of fun. Everybody's really great. Uh, I don't want to give too much away. But, uh, There's a guy with horn nipples. Yeah, though. there is. Check I it saw out that on Facebook. On, I saw the that on Facebook. Secrets. That can't yeah. be a spoiler. A oh, guy no. with horn nipples. Oh yeah, that's that's our little beast man. Mm-hmm. He's uh, pretty terrifying in the film. Is it really scary looking? Uh yeah, it's gonna be pretty terrifying. <laughs> Yeah. It should kind of crawl under your skin a little bit. If it's oh. got Todd Sheets on and it, it's got to be creepy. So it's yeah. something you need to see in the morning and not before you go to bed. I don't know. Yeah. I'd say you see it before you go to bed and oh. see what kind of dreams you have. <laughs> <laughs> That's just me. But <laughs> what role do you play in House uh, of Forbidden I Secrets? actually play Cassie Traxler. Mm-hmm. Um and I kind of line. instigate a lot of things. There's a lot of noise. Yeah, going that's on the here, cell man. phone. Somebody's mm. got their cell phone on. <laughs> I set mine to stun. <laughs> yeah. Uh, no, I. No, mine's silent. I don't know where mine is. But anyway, uh, no, I, yeah. I play Cassie Traxler. And Cassie she's, Traxler. Yeah. I she's like pretty it. awesome. She kind of helps keep things on track or destroys things, however you want to look at it. Did you help develop the role yourself or it was I all written not. for you? I mean, it, it was all scripted out. Mm-hmm. Um, I, ma- I make it my own. I do every now and then decide that some of the lines I wouldn't say like that, you mm-hmm. know, as an actor would, and talk to your director, talk to the writer, see if it's okay. And uh, if Did you change a few things around, that's He want you to him. talk... In an English accent the whole time? Oh, God, no. <laughs> oh. No, he didn't want me to do that. I could have. I would have if he wanted me to. But this I is didn't. Brad's first film, though, right? Is it? Is I, it I think it's his first <laughs> go around. Is he, he's that much of a professional. that you're he's like, pretty oh, awesome. He's, he, he looks like he's been acting for years now. <laughs> so, no, I've uh, really wanted to get both of them on the show just to talk about. Yeah, uh, no, it's really cool. Um, however. Uh, well, they've all been on the show. Just yeah, they've all been on the show in one, some fashion, but uh, talk about uh, House of Forbidden yeah. Secrets because that's the big stuff. This weekend is awesome. This weekend is going to be the big weekend. Weekend. weekend where what's, we what's have the big weekend. The big weekend is where we have uh, Lou Temple. He's he plays Axel in The Walking Dead currently. He's nice. been in a lot of uh, Rob Zombie films, Devil's Rejects, things like that. Mm-hmm. Um, and then Diane Thorne, really big cult actress, kind of retired for a while. She's coming back. This is like her first semi big thing since I don't know early 90s 80s I don't know how long ago yeah this could revive Um, everything for her yeah and we have a lot of really cool people that are coming in town this week and we're gonna hang out make some awesome shots for a film 10 hour shoot 12 hour shoot probably gonna be like 12 to 15 hours (laughs) make some good connections all day start start Friday and then end whenever (laughs) this is your first foray into the horror genre yeah Uh, with uh, conversely though Crystal you've got Mm -hmm. uh, like six minute demos online of you just screaming <laughs> I, I started uh, screaming on film. That's where I started. I did a lot of theater in college. I know Nicole's done a lot of theater in mm-hmm. college, and 
Um, I did. Did film. you go to Park University? I did not. Oh, okay. I hear they have a great <laughs> soccer team. Yes, and a theater department. Absolutely. Yeah. Um, no, I started out. I was in American Maniacs with Ashlyn Yinney from The Human Centipede, mm. um, directed by Chris Downs. Uh, see him, Downs, and he's super awesome. Did a lot of stuff with people in the IFC, and that's mm-hmm. where I actually started. Was in the IFC. That's where I met these people. And what? What? Got to represent up in here. That's right. And uh, yeah, so I did that, and I did taking a Savannah with Jeff Chitty. It was a crazy little grindhouse film mm-hmm. where uh, I killed people and took names. Sweet. And um, <laughs> screamed a lot in that, but I've been trying to do a lot more um, not as bloody and screaming. So Are you trying to get away from that? Just just well, to expand your horizon? Expand my horizons, but I do love the good horror film. I mm-hmm. wouldn't mind being a scream queen, but um, I do love to uh, get my drama tro- chops going. Heck yeah. um, this is my official... Uh, uh, out of work actor plug. Anybody yep. out there who has any scripts? Looking to film anything? Crystal. Do they have to fulfill a nudity clause? <laughs> <laughs> has anybody come up and said you have nice? Yeah. Has anybody ever came up to you <laughs> after a screening? Uh, nice. Not to be awkward, but pr- yeah. Really? Um, actually, when I had, I had auditioned <laughs> for House of Forbidden Secrets, and uh, <laughs> one of the guys that was actually in the audition and uh, he was filming it, he's like Wayne. He was like. Were you in taking of Savannah? This, it, yeah, it? I was like, uh, yeah, good. like right before audition. So now I had a, like this thing. He's seen me, and I'm all weird. Aww, so great auditions. So. Did, so, but he didn't. He didn't go nice boobs. <laughs> no, thank God. What a weirdo. <laughs> he I did know, probably in that? his head who though. Who goes up to actors? Nobody does. You, do. well, you do. You do. Me. <laughs> But no, um, I'm also working on a... I take that back. In the porn industry, it probably would be appropriate to compliment yeah, them on their exactly. anatomy. Oh, I, yeah. Great stories with people working with but that stuff. But <laughs> the, I, the IFC is not really d- the porn no. industry. No, 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 no. no, no. Independent no. Filmmakers and we do also Coalition. do G-rated things yeah. for kids. Good. Sometimes. We're very... Yeah. We, we, we like to do serious everything. things. We do everything. Yeah, you run the whole gamut. to sci-fis to, oh, yeah. um, to horror, but we... Horror. And <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? Uh, what, what's your ideal? My deal, I really am currently really loving drama. I mm-hmm. want to do a good dra- a dramatic yep. um, I think thing, that's a know? lot of thing with like a lot of actors. I mean, I was reading something that said something about uh, you know that you're in the acting business when, when you, you almost die because you get your dream role of being a junkie. Cause that's <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's, it's really, you know, but Testing. but I do love the horror genre because you get to, to you people are like, oh, you just scream and cry, but really, actually, you have to really get there to make oh, it yeah. look really, really good, or I have to get there. So, you know, props to you and doing doing. Oh, horror, we'll, we'll see. Yeah. A lot of I, I know that uh, a lot of times, uh, uh, sometimes you'll you'll think that you're one way, and then all, another genre will just find you. Uh, Take and point. Uh, I go both ways. Yeah, that's what I've heard. It was on your profile. But Le- Leslie Nielsen, you know, was a big dramatic actor, you know, and then if he just like decided to do uh, was it airplane? airplane, airplane as a goof, and then he was just comedy all the way. So maybe you just haven't found that niche yet, but something could find you, and uh, you could be like Leslie Nielsen. Wait, that wouldn't be good at all, actually. He's he dead. has great yeah. hair, though. He did have great hair. Like, <laughs> Phil Donahue type hair. But <laughs> Crystal and Nicole, thank you very much for uh, joining us tonight on the Big Dumb Fun Show. I'm glad you were able to find us, like us. We like you. Have a great night. <laughs> <laughs>